So this week's event is called Rare Spawn Hunt. It starts tomorrow, 5 p.m. UK time, 9 a.m. Pacific on Tuesday the 8th of October and lasts until Tuesday the 15th of October. Stay tuned for further details. How's it going, guys? My name is DPJ and I'd like to thank you for stopping by and checking out the video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps me out and subscribe if you want more Borderlands 3. Also, I'm giving away copies of Borderlands to win one for yourself or a friend. Simply make sure you are subbed to this channel and have notifications turned on. Drop a like on the video and leave a comment down below. Okay, so if you've explored the untamed wilds and urban hideouts of Borderlands 3, you've likely found a rare spawn boss. These named enemies are lurking around the many corners of the galaxy and will sometimes show up on your bounty boards. During the rare spawn hunt week, the rare spawns I will talk about in a second are guaranteed people to show up in their designated locations and have an increased chance to drop unique legendary loot. So let's get into the enemies where they spawn and the loot they drop. All buses will be timestamped people within the top of the comments section and within the video description if there's a certain boss you are looking for. Okay so first up we have Rackman who has the Nightflyer legendary pistol. He's located on Carnivora on Pandora, and as you can see on screen now, he's hiding away in a back cave marked on the map. Go here, and he will have an increased chance in dropping a variant of the Night Flyer. Next up we have Owl Dragon Jr who has unleashed the dragon which is a legendary artifact. He's located on the Jacobs Estate area of in Eden 6, marked and showcased on screen now. Now like many other instances you will see here guys because it isn't rare spawn week yet when recording these videos they ain't always gonna be here but upon this event week they're guaranteed to be here people. <laughs> Next up we have Road Dog who has the red line shotgun and is located within the splinter heads on Pandora. So load into the pit stop and follow the route I take on screen now to his location.
of Indoor Tyrant who has random customizations for you. He is located within Floodmore Basin upon Eden 6, so spawn into Knotty Peak and follow the route I take on screen now. Couldn't hit a cow's arse with a banjo. Next up, we have Force Troopers, who have random legendary class mods. These are located upon Atlas City and Promethea. So follow the route I take on screen now to their location. Dragons, who has random legendary shields and is found on Pandora in the Drought's area. So follow the route I take on screen now to find your foal. This junker needs more boost. Bloody my knuckles. the unstoppable who has the band of cytorek i believe that's pronounced it's a legendary shield and he's found upon eden 6 upon amber Mir area so spawn into rogues hollow and follow the path i take on screen now Oh, my God. 
Duncan Slough, who has the It's Piss, which is a legendary grenade mod. These are found on Pandora within the Conrad's Hold area, so follow the route you see me take on screen now. A trillion who has the Horizon legendary shotgun. He is found upon Eden 6 within the voracious canopy area. Found via the route I take on screen now. and Nate's who has the so-called Stabber, which is a legendary pistol. He is found upon Promethea within the Meridian outskirts area, so follow the route you see me take on screen now to his destination.
have the Princess Tarantula 2, who has the Hive, which is a legendary rocket launcher, and is found within the Splinterlands area upon Pandora, so I spawn into the Chop Shop area and follow the route I take. Mother of Dragons, who has a random legendary artifact. She is located upon Eden 6 within the Anvil area, so follow the route you see me take on screen now to find her and her dragons. Up to go. Next up we have Red Jabba, who has a random legendary grenade mod. He is located within Eden 6 within the Amber Maya area, so I spawn into the rogue's hollow and follow the route I take on the screen now. Whew. the used enforcer who has the masterwork crossbow which is a legendary sniper and he is located on Promethea within the electricity area so I spawn in as I do and follow the route I take to your target people and guys those are this next week's special events bosses which are guaranteed to spawn and have increased legendary loot drop rates which is epic so get farming people if there's something here you want so yeah guys I hope this guide helps you out I really do each boss will be timestamped at the top of the comment section as well as in the video description if there's a certain boss you need to check out. And I do indeed people hope the video helps you out. On that note, I'm out. Thanks as always for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed the video. I really do. If you did, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want more Borderlands 3 videos, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.